The highly anticipated coronation of King Charles III is this weekend, and we're going to show you some ways that you can celebrate today in the city, starting at Hawksmoor, a London transplant steakhouse on East 22nd Street. Patty, so you guys in the UK, you do something called the Sunday Roast. Talk to me about that tradition. Yeah, a, sun a Sunday Roast is a, a classic tradition in the UK. I think everyone will either be sat around the table with their families, friends, or go to a pub or a restaurant and have that sharing experience. So a Sunday roast will be, as a, as a single serving, slow roast rump beef with all of the trimmings, crispy roast potatoes, bone marrow gravy. We're eating like kings today. Who needs brunch? And also, because we're celebrating the coronation, what are you guys doing for that? Coronation chicken is, uh, is a dish that would have been first served for Queen Elizabeth's coronation in 1953. And here, our take on it is a crispy chicken sandwich with mango ketchup, lime pickle mayonnaise and a mango slaw. That's really good flavor. Wow. And there's something else you're doing too. Yeah, so uh, a sherry trifle dates back as far as when King James I would have been on the throne. Here we've gone for a 20-year-old Oloroso sherry, um, sherry custard and sherry jelly with fresh raspberries, whipped cream, toasted almonds. Boozy. Yeah, very boozy. That's really good. Yeah. Wow. I mean, I know you live here in New York now, but what's everyone at home saying? Are they excited for the coronation? Yeah, it's, it's history and tradition and a uh, very exciting thing. And I love that you guys are celebrating here with some delicious stuff. Cheers. Cheers. Next up, we are at Joneswood Foundry on East 76th Street. Jason, it's great to see you. Nice to see you too, thank you for coming. We're very excited to be here because this is the place to party for the coronation this weekend. I think it will be, yes. <laughs> Plenty of partying will be had. So we kick off on Saturday for the actual coronation. That would be a 5.30 a.m. kickoff. So you've got the full English breakfast. Then we go into brunch, which will start at 10 a.m. And we're launching the new spring menu for on, on the Saturday evening and then we repeat the whole thing again. There'll be a bit of music in between lunch and dinner in the, in the garden. And then we'll do the same thing again on Sunday minus the breakfast. These are actually things that King Charles III likes. Yeah, so this is a rainbow trout. Underneath there is just melted purple potatoes and leeks. He's into mushrooms. So this is an asparagus risotto, but it has um, crispy maitake mushrooms. Mm, very good. And then you got banoffee pie that has nothing to do with anything, really. <laughs> <laughs> just good. Yeah, don't miss out on that. And you also have um, these commemorative mugs. My uncle is a, he's a cartoonist, and this is just a caricature of Bonnie Prince Charlie, who will be, who is now, but will be the King of England. So for people who want to partake in the festivities, should they make a reservation? I would highly recommend it, yeah. To King Charles III. Cheers, yeah, thank you. Thank you.